Ave Maria, brothers and sisters. Thank you for joining our Mother and Refuge of the End Times. We invite you to post your prayer intentions below so that we can pray with you and for you. Let us pray for discernment, wisdom, and guidance as we listen to this next message. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Come, O Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful and enkindle in them the fire of your love. Send forth your Spirit, O Lord, and they shall be created, and you shall renew the face of the earth. What Mary looked like according to the newly approved San Nicholas vision. The apparitions of Mary of the Rosary of San Nicholas was recently approved as having a supernatural character and being worthy of belief by Bishop Hector Sabatino Cadelli of San Nicolas de los Arroyos in Argentina. Mary appeared to the uneducated housewife Gladys Carrigo de Mota over the course of six and a half years in the 1980s, giving her around 800 messages. Marian apparitions are, of course, not unheard of among the faithful, but have you ever wondered what Mary looks like when she appears? Well, in 1984, about a year after the vision started, Gladys tried to describe what it was like to meet and converse with the Blessed Virgin. In addition to saying that Mary was wearing blue, holding Jesus in her arms, and holding a rosary in her hand, here's what Gladys said. Today I wish to say how I see the Most Holy Virgin Mary. Her beauty is not easy to describe, but she is beautiful. And in her, the humility, the force, the purity, and the love with a capital letter. Because all the love of the world, I believe, that it does not cover the love that she feels for her children. When she orders, I feel the force of what she has. When she gives advice, I feel her maternal love. And when she says to me that she suffers for those that have moved away from the Lord, she transmits her sadness to me. All this leaves in me this wonderful mother to whom I have consecrated my life. I do this so that my dear brothers can know somehow how our Heavenly Mother is. Very interesting. In lots of ways, this sort of description seems to make a lot of sense. Of course, the glorious, immaculate, holy mother of God is hard to describe.